Alright, so I have a pretty funny video. Well, it's funny to me. It's funny because ever since the beta opened up, a lot of people are picking Conor McGregor. I don't blame them at all. But, I wanted to run with Paul and see what I could do. Is it enough to take down Conor? We'll see. already know in this fight I'm pretty much at a disadvantage in every single category so what I'm going to do is pretty much dance we're at a school dance right now it's prom night and I'm a dance bro so here we go I'm gonna pretty much slow it down because Connor on this game you cannot trade shots you can depending on who you have but you do not want to trade shots and you do not want to get caught like that Paul Felder is slow, man. Every time I swing, my stamina drops completely. Okay. Okay, so he's going to be pretty aggressive with Connor, which I don't blame them. If I had Connor and I was fighting Paul, man, I would, I would turn up. I swear I would. So let me just kind of get out the way and make sure I don't get hit with anything too powerful. Then again, with Connor, it just, it really just takes that straight, man. That straight will rock you. Then, of course, the head kick and everything will rock you. And people on here, they don't throw hooks or uppercuts, so I don't have to really worry about that. Oh, come on, Paul Felder. That needed to land. Oh, good. Connor's getting the head movement going. I thought he was kicking. Oh, we both kicked. He threw a head kick. I got rocked. All good. I was expecting that. You're going to get rocked on UFC 3, fam. Don't panic. Fall back. Get your health back. Man, never mind. Once again, fall back. Get your health back. Connor is too strong. Too quick. I'm good, though. I'm good. I'm not stressing. One, two, landed for Connor. We're chilling. Head kick. It landed. He thought he got out the way, but it landed. Okay. I'm here with you, bro. I'm not nervous. One, two. Should have thrown that uppercut after. Get out the way. Watch out for that length. No, sir. We get out the way. He's trying, bro. He's trying. Doubling up on the jab. And watch out for that. Leg kick. Uh-uh. I know he's going to get mad to make a mistake. That is my game plan. Make him mad. Make him swing a lot. And then counter. All you need on here is one counter. One chance. There we go. Look, he's trying to sway out the way. He's going to get caught. Head kick. Land it. Have him rock. Felder too slow to really do anything. Okay. All good, bro. He's looking mad human right now. He's looking mad vulnerable right now. Ooh, good fire back. Never mind, bro. I was just playing chill. Can't take a joke, Connor. I was just playing. But against some people, against some characters on this game, this is what you have to do. Slow it up. Kind of pick the shots. And really... I feel like that's how you should play UFC 3 anyway, but I know how it is, bro. Like, I just get caught up in trying to knock somebody out, and even then, I end up getting knocked out. So, man, this game, I feel like you have to take take it a little bit slower than UFC 2. Popped them at the end of the round. So that was actually a pretty decent round, bro. Let me find out Paul can hang with Connor. And I really jumped online to use Paul because he just won a fight. UFC 218, it was a good card in my opinion. But I said, let me jump on UFC 3 really quick. Use Paul no matter what, no matter who I'm fighting. It just so happens that we're fighting Connor. That was a good leg kick right there. And so, we'll see what I can do in round two. It's going to be more of the same, a little bit more dancing. And I might attack a little bit more, man. I might have to attack more because just moving isn't good enough against Connor. Because Connor can end the fight at any moment. You know, I have fights recorded where I just. Out of nowhere. Slip, uppercut, fight is over. Done. So let's go ahead and get into round two. Let me see what he's trying to do. I'm, oh, he wanted to touch up. I was about to say, I know he's not trying to touch up. Watch out. And I want people to do this more. Like, try going online and use people. They're not bad, but their stats are lower than the other people. I like doing that from time to time because I feel like it makes me better at the game. And for me, it helps my defense. 
Because with people like this in this certain matchup, I do not want to get touched by Connor. If I get touched, it's a rock. Just like that. So it helps me with my defense. It helps me with my countering. And it makes me uh, fight smarter. So when I do use somebody that's in the 90s, oh, I be tearing it up, bro. I tear it up. One, two, three, four. So I want to, it's not really a challenge for most people, but, ooh, a knockdown. The hook. I told you I'm going to attack a little bit more, Connor. He goes to the leg. I'm here, bro. I tried to go to the body. I tried. Let me see what he's trying to do, man. One, two, three. I'm on your head. I am on your head. He's still pushing, though. He feels confident with Connor. I don't blame him. On this game, I feel like any moment, though, it could be an upset. Leg kick. I'm turning it up a little bit. Kick to the body. I'm just trying to land. I did not land enough in the first round. Oh, one, two, three. I like throwing three hooks on here. I don't know why. I do that a lot. He blocks that. Double jab thrown out. Another double jab. Another jab. Another jab. Jab, man, 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 man. We're good. Watch out. Uh-uh. Matrix. Leg kick. Body kick. He hates that, man. The uppercut landed. The three-piece. The head kick. Connor is down. Hey, yo, imagine that. A lot of people think Connor is unbeatable online. It depends on how you play him, bro. It really depends on how you play him. I like to slow the fight down against Connor and counter, and that's all you need sometimes. Because people that use Connor for the most part, they swing away, bro. They swing away. You just need one little head kick, one counter, and it's good night. Man, that was a pretty fun thing to do. I might do this more often. You know when the game comes out, I'm using everybody, bro. I don't care what their stats looking like. It's lit. I hope you all enjoy the gameplay. Take care. Peace.